meet you because I have some questions. Questions? <laughs> yes. We're here today at OGC Nice. Um, super exciting uh, project which is um, bringing together all of the different areas of performance within INEOS Sport and have the unique experience that you're not just developing a competitive advantage you're in one sport you're learning all of those competitive advantages across multiple sports. Ce qui est quand même euh, assez unique pour nous c'est qu'on on fait partie de, de le groupe de sportif de, de INEOS et on profite de ça. On a eu le plaisir aujourd'hui d'avoir euh, Ethor qui est un expert de, de l'équipe de Tour de France, euh, surtout en euh, nutrition d'endurance. Euh, ben Williams qui euh, est le, le directeur de performance de l'Ineos Carnardi et puis aussi il travaille avec l'équipe America's Cup. Et on va voir aussi euh, James Morton qui est un professeur de, de l'université de, de Liverpool, un expert de, sur la nutrition aussi qui vient pour travailler ici avec euh, l'équipe ici pour essayer de regarder comment on peut améliorer, qu'est-ce qu'on fait dans les autres équipes euh, de nutrition pour être sûr que tout le groupe travaille euh, au plus haut niveau. Until now, the six or seven last years, we were trying to individualize a lot. And uh, I would like to ask how we better to give them all the same or are we better to those everyone that we do and if we do the both is it uh, is it bad for some aspect um but i think there are some some things that you can individualize and they make the difference some others they don't so i think we have to focus really on those key elements that we know that they make the difference they cannot get from others food other food sources or whatever definitely we're going to be here working for some days uh, doing some meetings, trying to understand how we can help them and learn from, from this sport to, to finally try to increase their performance. We have a lot of knowledge across all of Ineos sport and on a foundational level it's relevant um, across all of the areas. You know, we've got these deep disciplined practices of, of knowledge across these different areas. Uh, I think the, the exciting part and the competitive advantage part is understanding where the cross collaboration is and where we can transfer knowledge to create a competitive advantage. On, on fait tous les mêmes choses et on partage entre nous euh, qui fait quoi, comment, qu'est-ce qu'on peut apprendre de l'un à l'autre pour essayer d'augmenter le niveau de, de toutes les équipes. It's always good to have a different point of view, you know, yeah. and when we, when we work in a sport for a long time, people coming from uh, uh, outside this world. Yeah. It's good to, to have the different opinions and different yeah. feedback also. I do think that the, the notion of high performance culture is growing in any of sport because the ambition from the owners is go, you know, go hard and go big um, and that's super exciting. And the ambition will be we'll share more time with each other. It's not just a couple of days here and there, you know, we're, we're really starting to expand on how we leverage the expertise across different sports. Il y a plein de disciplines où, euh, où on travaille euh, et ça fait plaisir quand même de, de voir euh, que cet échange euh, entre toutes les équipes euh, se pratique de plus en plus.